program like this one is essential really for our industry. To get young people keen again about practicing their craft and showing what they potentially can do. And we are seeing the standard rise every year. Today we've got seven of the best from all over and, and I like to think that we give them a bit of a stepping stone. And we need all the fresh new ideas that keep uh, our industry really exciting. It is the most fantastic experience possible. I got involved in the program, I guess, to lift my profile and uh, to create more exposure. Having the chefs that we're judging today sort of look down and go, well, this is the next upcoming chef, I mean, that'd be fantastic for me. This program could help me achieve what I want to achieve in the future. To get involved in the program, sort of challenge myself, bring a bit more awareness to, to me and um, to Adelaide in general. I mean, they are pretty amazing young people. We like to mentor them as well, and, and you know, they've got a, a base to come to if they need advice. What we're looking for is confidence, um, but also being humble as well. I think it's really important that they develop their own cooking style or understand what is actually inspirational to them. My philosophy on food is basically getting back to the basics and methods and preparation of cookery. I like to cook in a simple way. Try not to overcomplicate whatever the main ingredient is. Creating a dish that makes a customer think about what they're eating. Anything that can raise the standard and develop a camaraderie and a network and mentoring has got to be good for the industry. It, it's just the experience of putting yourself under pressure like that. It, you know, you see the cream rise to the top has just been. Doors and opportunities open from doing stuff like this. There's light at the end of the tunnel.